Pokemon Scarlet and Violet just came out yesterday. What up, guys? Nick from What Up MC here. Without further ado, let's just jump right into it. Wait a minute. All right, let's go. <clears throat> this is me. I am Nick. I am in Paldea. Enrollment application, Yuva Academy. Whoa! Regional Tauros? Pokemon Violet. Woo! All I know is this is the one that rolls and not the one that runs, even though he has a wheel. Okay, is that the map of the region? It's pretty regularly shaped. It's just like a big blob. What happened when regions used to be some kind of weird... You know, like Gen 1 to 4, they were all... And 5 was like a... Look at that, you know? Just a blob. Galler's just like, whoop. This one's just like a whoop. You know? The director, and you came in person to help my son with his first day? Well, I am responsible for the entire academy, including any, any failures. <laughs> like letting this freaking get into the school. And he's panicking. He's like, shit, I gotta stop Nick before he gets there. <laughs> but your living room is hardly the place for it. Would you care to follow me outside? He just said, y'all house is trash. <laughs> he's like, I couldn't stand to be in here one second longer. I don't know why I gave him this accent. It's just, he looks so dandy. Even though I know we're supposed to be in Spain. I'll ask you to choose which of- Okay, I need it. What's his voice? This is- Every time I do it, I'm like, there's no way he sounds like this. I'll ask you to choose which among these three you'd like to have as your partner. Sprigatito, Fuecoco, the Fire Croc Pokemon. Wait, what? I just went to Italian. How do I do Spanish? And Quaxley. That wasn't it. That wasn't Spanish. <laughs> I love Fuecoco's face. I'm sure they have lots to teach you. What the? What the hell? Hold on. Did you guys see that? We haven't met yet, have we? I must say, I wasn't expecting to see you. Imagine if the only way you knew who was talking is if the person's like waving their hand like this. Just imagine being at a party or in a big group of people and every time somebody starts talking, they just start to go like this. Like you just hear like a random voice. You're like, well, who was it? Oh, oh, it was you. You didn't put up your hand. All right. Uh... What the hell was that? I think the sun just moved a couple hundred thousand miles. The whole like world just got brighter when I clicked the Pokemon. Wait. <laughs> Ooh, a dark cloud is passing over. What will happen now? Aw, I thought it was gonna just obliterate the cloud. <laughs> oh, look at his face. How can he not pick this guy? Look at him. Would you like to give Fue Coco a nickname? Re Rita. That's it. Please, please. Pick Quaxley. I don't want any of this picking the type I'm good against bullshit. No! Alright then. Okay, Game Freak. Do we really think kids are this stupid? They need one Pokemon on the enemy's team. They're going to be battling the most to be weaker than your Pokemon. Does, do they not have other types? Does it really matter? I trust you remember that Master Nick is... Wooly? Inexperienced Pokemon battling. Hey, whoops, good call, Director. Was she actually about to like freaking whip out a level 60 Pokemon or something? Please have Ember. Can I just kill her in one move? Of course I don't have Ember. What do we got? Tackle. <gasps> I do have Ember. <laughs> stupid, stupid cat. Wow, I could have never seen this coming. I also packed a lunch for your first day. Sandwich from mom. I'm never eating this. I'm gonna keep this till the end of the game. Okay, why is she so much taller than me? I feel like she's gonna beat me up for my lunch money. Am I trying to catch this catch this Lechonk? Woo! Ooh, nice. I like the shakes are kind of fast. Registered. Would you get, like to give Lechonk a nickname? Machonk. To Tarantula. I get it. He's a tarantula, but he's round. Whoa! Okay, Tarantula's been dated a bit. The hell did you just say? If it doesn't die from this, I will catch it and name it Mellow because it's a girl. I'm gonna go get her. You guys have to see her new haircut. Can you guys see those growling noises? You guys hear the growling noises she makes? She doesn't like being picked up when she's chilling. She clearly doesn't like staying here. Look, she has your haircut. Wow, you're so clean. And you don't want to stay here. <laughs> <laughs> Is it cold here because there's a fan and you have no more fur? Bye bye. Come here with me. There's a bed. I, where are you going? Mouse? This is a mouse? I thought it was a dog. What do I do? Four? 
You got you. Oh, that wasn't her. I thought that was her reaction to seeing how many Pokemon I caught. I never heard that kind of cry before. It could be some strong Pokemon or something. I said we find whatever made that cry. Let's take a look around, Nick. Just be careful. There's kind of unsafe cave. Not what number one thing to do when they're around an unsafe cave. Don't go investigating weird noises. Everyone knows that. Mm -hmm. What? Oh, it's uh, the M or K. Uh, I think it's M. I think it's Maridon. Mysterious Pokemon seems to be too weak to move. Maybe you can give it something to help it perk up. No, my sandwich. I was going to save that for the end of the game. Surely you would want to eat this phone, right? You're a machine. No. You, I was going to save it. It's reusable. How's that reusable? <laughs> Is it going to come out the other end? Whoa, got the turbo boosters. Okay, this is my friend Damiano. Oh, you're behind the microphone thing. From the channel Geeking Comfortably. Have you started playing yet? No, I didn't get the game yet. Oh, okay. Yeah. I have both. Um, <laughs> so I just met Maridon, as I correctly guessed its name, because I remembered one of them was an M and the other one was a K. Oh, <laughs> I did not prepare for this. Oh, he called the droops. Oh, shit. <laughs> Did I just go unconscious? I'm like limp in his arms. <laughs> I'm not moving. All right, let me ride. Not yet. We're not there yet. What are you doing out there? Out here. Oh, he knows Maridon. Wait, I know you. Aren't you Arvin? You, or you're an old in the humanities track, right? And are you the son of that Pokemon researcher, Professor Turo? This guy, this guy looks super old. Doesn't matter who my dad is. Surprise, wait, I'm pretty sure, isn't Turo the professor that everybody says is like, the hot professor? Yeah, isn't that the husband of? Yeah, how is this guy his son? He look. This guy looks like he could be the other guy's dad. <laughs> this guy looks so old. This dude is talking shit on me and he's got a level five of school bet. Now imagine coming out here looking like you've been a Pokemon trainer for 50 years and you got a level five of school bet. <laughs> <laughs> That's what this guy looks like. Nice. Well, that was his only Pokemon. But you better actually show up for school. Oh my god. I thought she was, like, way older than me. And I was confused that we were in the same class. Thinking that I'm, like, 10 and she's 20. Yeah, but this guy's, like, 50. <laughs> Look, Nick. That's Mesa Goza. Oh, jeez. Icy mountain in the back. That looks cool. Mountains, forests, grasslands, beautiful nature stuff as far as the eye can see. Wow, <laughs> the, the low res view of the trees. And you know what's waiting for you all over these natural spaces? Tons of Pokemon. Even though she doesn't she doesn't even like catching, she just likes battling. Consider this me officially telling you, welcome to Paldea. All right, guys, I think that's going to be it for the first video from the Pokemon Violet playthrough from the live streams. If you want to be notified for the next live stream or for when the next video comes out, then hit the subscribe button down below. But yeah, that's it. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you guys next time.